Hello guys, Kieran here. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Uh, today we're going to be doing kind of another tutorial video. Uh, this is uh, a application. It's called Borderless Windowed. Uh, it allows you to run uh, Flight Simulator X or any other application uh, without the uh, windowed. Uh, sorry, should I say without the uh, annoying border of Windows 10 or Windows 7 uh, underneath it, which is extremely annoying, especially Flight Simulator. Uh, if you if you if you know if you run two monitors or three monitors or however many monitors you run, you'll know that when you access full screen mode on Flight Simulator, it'll disable these monitors, so it's pretty much deemed useless. Um, but it's really really annoying, especially when you you want things like checklists, charts, things like that. Um, I understand that there is an actual there is an application out there called FSX Borderless Windowed, uh, specifically designed for FSX. Now, for some reason, this didn't work for me. I much prefer this one because it allows you to do it with other games as well, so not just Flight Simulator. You know, I, I could run kind of I don't know. Uh, if there's another game, there's probably another game out there which does the same thing as Flight Sim, where it closes your other monitor. It's it's really annoying, but. There is a way to get around it, I promise you. So it's very, very simple. I'll leave the link in the description to the download. Simply download it. It'll prompt you with everything you need to. You just click the application when it comes up on the WinRAR or your files or whatever. You double click it. It'll install the application. And it should appear in the bottom right hand corner here in this little tab display thing. So all you need to do is click it. And it'll display this uh, screen here, the settings. Uh, you click add. And then you select what you want uh, the windowed, um, what you want, um, you know, to to be able to, to be compatible with this. So, in 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 this case, we're going to be clicking fl uh, using Flight Simulator. So you click Flight Simulator X, and it should appear here in the in the box on the right hand side. And you can just obviously look at that and confirm that. Then you click off it, and then you well, I'll demonstrate. Um, I'll demonstrate now uh, what it does. So we'll just spawn in with the, with the ultralight on the Friday Harbour. And boom, there you go. As you can see, we've got none of the annoying Windows 10 stuff in the bottom. And to prove to you that my uh, it is working, if you just listen listen to the game volume now. And there it's stopped because I clicked on my other monitor. And then we'll click black. And off it again. And back. And off it again. So, uh, yeah, there's your proof if you need it. So I hope you found this. Um, I hope you obviously go down and install this. It is it's very good and and it helped it helped me out a lot. You know I was getting really annoyed with having to like use my tablet and stuff for for charts and then I figured this out. So, so hey. thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and uh, I've just actually finished recording a video on uh, the new Carinata C90 GTX. Um, so that video will be coming out very shortly. Well, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a wonderful day, and uh, thank you. Bye-bye.